Teams must now travel by ferry to Prince Edward Island, where they will fly to the heart of the Canadian Shield, Sudbury, Ontario. With more than 300 lakes inside the city limits, covering 600 square kilometers, this is a nature lover's paradise. It's no wonder Sudbury is known as one of the happiest cities in the country. The Amazing Race Canada made its way to our backyard. NoronLife.ca went behind the scenes and got exclusive interviews with hosts John Montgomery, first place racers Gino and Jesse, and celebrity guest Alex Trebek. Here at the Bell Park Gazebo, teams will find three members of the Sudbury Symphony Orchestra and the pit stop for the sixth leg of the race. The last team to check in here may be eliminated. Oh, I've done many pass-bys on my way back and forth from Manitoba to Georgian College when I was going to school there in my early 20s and I guess late teens. The events that the racers are going to participate here in Sudbury are going to be awesome. The swimming challenge with the synchronized swimmers was a lot of fun for me because I was, well, to coin a phrase, a, a duck out of water or a synchronized swimmer out of water or in it for sure. Uh, not my comfort zone, but it was a lot of fun. Those girls are incredibly talented. And being at the hospital where they're going to be doing the EMS challenge, learning about CPR and actually learning some life skills that could potentially save someone's life down the road is the kind of thing which I think this show, the Canadian version, is really great for. Not only, you know, going around and doing some fantastic things, but learning something to take away, uh, being inspired by the greatness which surrounds us everywhere we go in this country. That's it right there. See the big nickel? Yeah, let's just go right through. There's a detour with a fast forward. Let's do this. Yeah, we're gonna do the fast forward. Teams will make their way to Science North, a science center that educates more than a quarter million people each year. Yes, I've been here once before, and uh, it's beautiful. Uh, what a nice place, it's very peaceful. Um, the people here are very, very nice, and uh, it's been a great experience so far. We went to Science North, that was really, really fun. We uh, got to feed some turtles, and halfway through, they told us that uh, we actually had to eat the same food as the turtles. Yeah. Are you serious? I'm serious, yeah. Oh, man, this sucks. Okay, just let me focus on doing this, and then I'll eat those after. Oh, is there um, a grasshopper? Oh, is that a cricket in there? Cricket. A cricket in there. A few worms. Some or... worms. Some super worms. Super worms, <laughs> yeah. And uh, we also had to go to valet mining, and we actually got to go down a kilometer into the earth. And we had to open up some uh, some ore and find the nickel, some nickel in there. Was, uh, we spotted cool. uh, we spotted a piece right away. Yeah, we had to pull out the guns and uh, <laughs> make some hard swings, but we got it through. Bring it in, boys! Hustle up! Gah! Boys, I know I don't need to, but let me introduce you to Alex Trebek. Congratulations! <laughs> I'm happy to welcome you to my hometown of Sudbury. It's an honor to be here. Uh, part of one of Canada's most successful television programs. And also, it's special because I get to come back to uh, the city in which I was born. Now that I've been here for a couple of hours, uh, the memories are coming back to me. The, the diving platforms used to be over there. Uh, this gazebo wasn't here then, it was a small uh, enclosure for band concerts on Sunday nights. But I used to swim down here, but the best place to swim was Moonlight Beach. I'm looking forward to seeing those spots and just uh, being able to relive some wonderful moments of many, many years ago.